Hey guys, welcome back. Here are the top five weird and crazy Japanese products. Number five, Silent Karaoke. It's no secret that karaoke is popular in Japan. In fact, Japan is inundated with karaoke clubs, where people can book private karaoke rooms to sing in. It's even common practice to hire karaoke coaches to help improve karaoke skills. And some machines will even rate the karaoke singer. It's no wonder then that the Japanese have a plethora of peculiar products related to karaoke. The silent karaoke microphone is no exception. This strange little product is essentially a large dome that you can place over your face to mute your singing. The microphone claims that it will eliminate 70% of the sound. And as if singing into a product that mutes your voice wasn't strange enough, the intention behind the microphone is even stranger. It's branded as a weight loss system. The manufacturers claim that singing very loudly will actually exercise your body and cause you to lose weight. Number 4. Chopstick Fans the chopstick fan claims to be suitable for anyone who can use chopsticks. Although they are not recommended for children under the age of 6, chopsticks, which were invented in China around 9,000 years ago, are the cutlery of choice in Japan. In fact, it's estimated that upwards of 24 billion pairs of disposable chopsticks are used each year, which averages out to around 200 pairs per person in Japan annually. But this crazy little invention takes chopsticks to a whole new level by cooling hot food with a fan. The fan is portable and can be slipped onto any pair of chopsticks. It was designed to help cool off hot ramen noodles, but of course it can be used to cool off any kind of food. You could even use it to cool off your ramen burger, which is a strange fast food option in Japan. Number 3. The Butter Grater the Japanese are known for trying to solve simple, everyday problems by creating crazy and wild products. The Butter Grater is a relatively new Japanese product that does exactly what it says. It grates a stick of butter like cheese. This odd product was designed to eliminate the difficulty that comes from trying to spread a hard stick of butter onto a piece of toast. The grater has a convenient slot that you can place your stick of butter into. From there, you simply twist the bottom of the device and the butter grates, coming out in small spreadable strands. And although it may seem like a strange and crazy product, the butter grater is actually a pretty popular product in Japan. So popular, in fact, that shortly after the first butter grater was introduced, a large number of other companies created similar products. One such company named Sorong came up with a smaller, more compact version of the butter grater. They call their version the butter mill. They claim that it not only helps spread butter, but that it also helps melt butter quicker as well. They suggest using butter mill for hot veggies and corn. The butter mill is featured on Amazon, and according to its specs, it's made of high-grade stainless steel. It's tiny too, at only about 4 inches, but with a product rating of just 1.8 out of 5 stars, I don't know if I'm going to be buying this anytime soon. Number 2. The Easy Earscope TV The Japanese are famous for creating strange and crazy beauty products, and the Easy Earscope TV is no exception. This medical looking device is meant for home use, and it claims to help you see inside your ear so you can clean them better. The Easy Earscope TV is equipped with a self-contained endoscope. It's designed so that you can see deep inside your own ears and get rid of your own stubborn earwax. Apparently, it has fiber optics and can easily connect to your video input on any television or monitor. This way, you can display the inside of your ear on your monitor. To use the Earscope TV, all you need to do is attach the ear spoon, switch on the LED lights, and put the tip of it in your ear. Manufacturers claim that the device is completely safe but I'm not so sure. The product is battery powered, portable, and compact. Manufacturers boast that its use is not just limited to inside your ears. It can be used to check your teeth, your scalp, or see inside your nose. Basically any part of your body that needs grooming where it's hard to see. And finally, number one. Since it rains a lot in Japan, the Japanese have come up with several strange modifications to the everyday umbrella. The first is the shoe umbrella. 
The shoe umbrella is essentially a tiny little umbrella that clips onto the tips of your shoes. The shoe umbrella was initially invented by K. Gilles Nawal in 2010. He wanted to find a way to increase the life of expensive footwear, so these umbrellas were designed to protect expensive shoes from the rain. Websites that sell umbrella shoes boast that the umbrellas have several other advantages. People who wear the shoe umbrella will no longer experience blisters from wet feet. And because their feet will stay dry, their feet won't be cold either. Their users won't have to change their wet socks at work ever again. It's certainly quite a fashion statement. The shoe umbrella comes in a variety of sizes and colors, and even come in sizes so small that you can slip them into your purse. They are usually sold separately, but if you were to buy two, you get a discount on a second umbrella. If your shoes aren't your main concern, but you like the idea of having an easily accessible umbrella, you could also buy the umbrella tie. It is essentially both a tie and a detachable umbrella. This crazy product is worn mainly in Japan by businessmen who fear getting caught in the rain. That's pretty crazy, but I have one more crazy umbrella product. If you really want it to stay dry to the level where you practically have a phobia to water, then you could buy the full body umbrella. The full body umbrella is exactly as it sounds. It's an umbrella that utilizes a normal umbrella, but then surrounds its users in a waterproof curtain that extends from the umbrella all the way to the ground. The sheath is made of high quality see-through plastic, and it guarantees that it will keep you perfectly dry, even on the wettest of days. Before we end today's video, we have some honorable mentions that didn't make the list. Japan has some pretty crazy food products as well, especially when it comes to fast food. Some wild examples of crazy food products in Japan include the Kiro Ninja Burger from Burger King and the Fio Grass Burger from Wendy's. These burgers are very unique and specific only to Japan. Japanese people love having snacks and a brand new snack craze has hit the streets of Amanchi, Japan. And it might be one of the weirdest Japanese food products of all time. They are apparently called Jibanshi Senbi, or wasp crackers. The crackers are made from sanai, which is a street Japanese style of rice cracker. But unlike other rice crackers, these crackers are full of black wasps. The wasps are caught in the countryside by laying traps. From there, they are boiled into water and then dried. Once dried, they're added into a rice cracker batter. The batter is put in a hot iron cracker cutter, and the wasp cracker is produced. These crackers are sold through gourmet stores and in local markets. But apparently, they're not just crunchy and strange, but also healthy as well. Wasps are incredibly high in protein. In fact, wasps are higher in protein than any other insect making wasp crackers a good alternative to meat. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Check out my previous video on the top 5 strangest art installations. And in the meantime, subscribe for more.